welcome back to my channel we're gonna do an unboxing my voice is back we back baby one of them i low-key opened because i just was really really tempted to try it and what's a better way than to give y'all a little bit of a review of what i you know got some of the stuff i didn't open i only opened two things one thing for my daughter one thing for me so let's get into what i opened for her first so i did an order from ancient cosmetics it's a homemade company and I could tell it's homemade. So boom, I took this out the box. I got a body butter for kids, right? A lot of the flavors that they have for kids were sold out. I wanted bubble gum, but bubble gum was sold out. So I got grape soda. The kid's dad said that was very black of me, but I just figured the kids would smell like grapes and that's a nice unisex smell versus the bubble gum I would have only used on my daughter. But anyways, you know, knowing that people be in a chokehold about stupid things like smelling like grapes. Anywho, I took it out and I'm like, dang, this thing is light. Did they jit me? No, they did not. They did not jit me, y'all. Okay? It's like this air, air weight light. I don't know how to explain it. It reminds me of like a marshmallow. Hold on, my son is whining. Anyways, I don't know. It just reminds me of like, I can't explain it, but it's so light, like. It's super duper light. I was like, oh my goodness, they jipped me. But no, honey, was filled to the very, very top. I only had to use a little bit on her the other night. And it's hard, as you guys can see. But like, I'm just like scraping, you know? Like my finger's not, you know? It's, I could push into it, but it's hard. So. They say you just like put it in the palm of your hand or whatever. And you see it's getting like a little oily consistency warming up in there and y'all let me tell you you would think this was like baby oil no it's like a thick shea butter oil and my daughter smelled like grapes all night literally like this thing smells so good it comes in like banana a couple of other flavors but i love this stuff so much i'm like i'm never buying nothing else for my kids and it's just homemade and i just respect a homemade business like yes thank you so delish and it's not greasy i don't know how to explain it y'all but it's really, 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 really nice on the skin. So let me show you what I got for me because the rest of the stuff is for moi. But you can use this too. It's just the kids line, but you can use it too. So I got like five of these. All right, hold on. These kids will make you snap. Anyways, I ordered like five boxes of this, you guys. It's a um even skin turmeric. So I tried it the other night. I tried it the other night in the shower. It dyed my little uh African like scrub. It dyed it orange. So they definitely use turmeric in this. And the bar is huge. And you can just tell it's homemade. And I just love me a homemade baddie. Like okay. Smells good. I used it on my face. No breakouts. Um, I'm liking it. I can't say whether it works or not because obviously you guys have only used it once. I'm not going to sit here and lie. Um, but whatever. The next soap that I tried to get, well, I didn't try it yet, but I ordered was Tropical Pineapple. I didn't open this up. Um, I just opened up the body butter and one of those turmeric soaps, which I will be using every day. And if I see a difference, you know, oh my goodness. Y'all, this smells like a pina colada, like amazing. I can't wait to use this. They got me wanting to go make some soap. I'm about to take a make a soap class. I don't want to open up a company or nothing, but I love making stuff. This is a healthy glow turmeric lemon body scrub. I figured this would pair well with the even skin. Although for the most part, my skin tone is even, but there's nothing wrong with just getting it together because I've noticed lately when I've been having pimples, although I do not pop them, I only put pimple patches on them, then they shrink down. I notice I'm still being like left with dark spots, so I'm hoping the turmeric can help lighten that. When I used to make my own turmeric stuff back in the Dizay, it worked. You feel me? And it would dye everything. So, you know, be cautious of that. Let me smell it. it smells very, very lemony. I like that. I'll be using this after I finish the body scrub that I already have in the bathroom because I don't know. I got this Even Skin Healthy Glow Body Oil. Yeah, yeah, get into that. Um, I don't know what it smells like. Let's see. I'm rubbing it up here on my arm only because 
Y'all saw me rub that grape in. I'm sure this doesn't have too much of a scent. I just got it because it said even skin. It doesn't smell like nothing. Not to me. I don't, I'm not getting nothing. Um, not that I would expect it to because it's just even skin. Then I got this one, brown sugar, because that just sounded like something I would like. They have a lot of other flavors, but this one just, I felt like I would like this one because I like warm scents. Um, so this one seemed the most my style. I don't mind tropical, but that's just not my vibe, especially this. Y'all, this shit smells like brown sugar. This is mine. I'm not sharing it, which is why I dip my finger into it because it's mine. This. Oh my gosh. Yo. Eating the girls up this winter. Smelling like a fucking cinnamon. It just really smells straight up like brown sugar. I don't even really want to say cinnamon, but it reminds me of the warmth of the cinnamon. Like, oh my gosh. I'm loving this. Y'all, right choice, right choice, right choice. I don't want to smell it too, too much. Because honestly, I don't know if it's because I'm getting older. But whenever I smell something too sweet, too, too much, I start to get a headache. This smells good, y'all. I got myself... A stretch mark butter. It had good reviews. Um, I had K's. I have stretch marks. Um, so I'm trying to. Uh, I want my skin to be as even as possible. Um, I don't want no dark spots. I would like no stretch marks. That's why I'm on my weight loss journey. Like I'm trying to just be given like new body, without surgery. This doesn't smell good. It doesn't stink. It has the same consistency as the other one. Like. You see, I'm pushing down hard, and it's not really making much of an indent. I like that. This is lightweight. I'm definitely going to start using this as well. Let's see. It doesn't really have a smell. If anything, it smells medicinal more than anything. But, I mean, it's a stretch mark cream, so I'm not expecting it to smell like, like this, like the tropical pineapple. But I think it's... This is the products are good from the two things that I use so far. I'm not gonna lie. I think this is like where I'll be shopping for like all my body products. Like I think y'all have a lifelong um partnership with your girl. I'm 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 locked in with this. I'm really, really feeling the products. I'm really, really feeling it, y'all. I think this is where I'll be shopping and just it being homemade and like no synthetic colors, no gluten, no parabens, no sulfates, no animal testing. Funny enough, my son is allergic to sulfate, so that's perfect. That was for the kids stuff. I'm just loving this and like all of this stuff, like I can read. I'm effing with it, y'all. Ancient Cosmetics, sponsor your girl because I will definitely be buying from you guys again. Definitely, hands down.